Welcome to Mastering Solutions. This is a multiple choice question where they give us this picture right here and they tell us that a two kilogram ball is suspended by two light strings and they want us to find what the tension is in the angled string. So right here we have tension. And so when we draw the free body diagram, we have tension right here. We'll also have weight. So weight going straight down. And then we also have tension coming this way from the other string. So we need to figure out what tension is in this string right here. Let's sum the forces in the y direction first. So we have some of the forces in the y direction and it's in static equilibrium. So it's going to be equal to zero because there's no acceleration. So we have tension and if we get the y component, it's going to be this spot right here and the angle here is 50. So it's going to be opposite to the angle right here. So we'll be using sine of 50, so T sine 50. And then we'll subtract from it because we're only looking in the Y direction for the forces, the weight, and that is all equal to zero as we talked about. MA is what it would be, but acceleration is zero. We can convert the W or the, for weight to MG. So we have T sine of 50 minus MG is equal to zero. And I will move it over to the other side. So T sine 50 is equal to mg. And then we want to find T, so we'll isolate T by dividing by the sine of 50. mg sine 50. So now T is equal to mg divided by the sine of 50 degrees. So now when we plug in our numbers to this, let's come over here just because there's more space. So mg. The mass we said is two kilograms. Gravity of course is 9.8 meters per second squared. And then we'll divide that all by sine of 50 degrees. So we have two times 9.8 divided by sine 50. And so we have 25.6. So for two significant figures, T will be equal to 26 Newtons. And so looking at our answer choices, 26 is choice D.